Today we have a new video for the U.S. Citizenship Test. The Civics Test is an oral test and you will be asked up to 10 of the 100 questions. This video will help you focus on specific answers to make the information easier to remember. You must answer 6 out of the 10 questions correctly to pass the test. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. J. What are two cabinet-level positions? Secretary of Defense, Secretary of Energy. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Freed the slaves. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? He fought for civil rights. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. What is one reason colonists came to America? Freedom. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Said that the United States is free. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? freedom of speech, and freedom of worship. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Any citizen can vote. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Separation of powers. There were 13 original states. Name three. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. Under our Constitution, 
some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. The Civil War. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote. Join a political party. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Religion. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War I. What is the economic system in the United States? Capitalist economy. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Obey the laws of the United States. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Mississippi. Name two national U.S. holidays. President's Day and Memorial Day. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and House. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. Name one U.S. territory. Puerto Rico. What do we call the first 10 amendments to the Constitution? The 
the Bill of Rights. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because of the state's population. What is the political party of the president now? Democratic. Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes. What did Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for women's rights. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Vote in a federal election. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? Louisiana. What major event happened on September 11, 2001 in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? Native Americans. Name one state that borders Mexico. Texas. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? 435. Who is the father of our country? Washington. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Roosevelt. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star-Spangled Banner. When must all men register for the Selective Service? At age 18. What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government. When was the Constitution written? 1787. Who signs bills to become laws?
the president. Who was the first president? Washington. Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The vice president. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life, liberty. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Freed the slaves. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Jefferson. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. What does the President's Cabinet do? advises the president. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? To provide schooling and education. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there are 50 states. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Pacific. Who is in charge of the executive branch? The president. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? U.S. Diplomat. Who vetoes bills? The President. What is an amendment? It's a change. 
During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. Name one state that borders Canada. Alaska. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Eighteen and older. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? People from Africa. Who makes federal laws? Congress. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. Who was president during World War I? Wilson. How many U.S. Senators are there? One hundred. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Navajo. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Pelosi. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All the people of the state. How many amendments does the Constitution have? Twenty seven. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15th. What does the judicial branch do? Explains laws. Who is the commander in chief of the military?
the president. What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. In what month do we vote for president? November. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? 1776. We elect a president for how many years? Four. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. What is the name of the President of the United States now? Biden. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Harris. Who is the governor of your state now? Answers will, will vary. Please go to usa.gov slash state dash governor to find your governor's name. Name your U.S. representative. Again, answers will vary here. Please go to house.gov to find your representative. Who is one of your state's U.S. senators now? For this question, you will need to find out your senators' names. Please go to senate.gov. What is the capital of your state? Answers will vary here as well. Thank you. Please leave comments below. And don't forget to subscribe.